Africa is the world's second largest and second most populous continent after Asia. With a total area of roughly 30.3 million kilometers square, when including neighboring islands, it takes up 6% of the Earth's surface area and 20% of its land area. With a population of about 1.3 billion as of 2018, it accounts for roughly 16% of the world's population. With a median age of 19.7 in 2012, compared to 30.4 globally, Africa has the youngest population of all the continents. Africa is the poorest continent in terms of per capita income, despite having an abundance of natural resources. This is partly because of geographical challenges, the Cold War's effects on post-European colonial Africa, Western and China's neo-colonialist activities, and China's undemocratic governments and harmful policies. Due to its recent economic growth and large, youthful population, Africa is a significant economic market in the global context, despite its low wealth concentration. The unemployment rate is defined as the proportion of the labor force that is unemployed. The unemployment rate includes individuals who can work but are not currently employed. Depending on the source, the global unemployment rate was projected to range between 6.3 to 6.5% in 2021. The unemployment rate is a lagging indicator, meaning that it responds to changing economic conditions rather than influencing or predicting them. When the economy expands at a healthy rate, the labor market is robust and the unemployment rate falls. In response to a recession or other economic turbulence, the job market tends to contract and the unemployment rate rises. Due to numerous educational, socio-demographic, and economic factors, youth unemployment is more prevalent in the majority of the world's regions. In 2022, the average African youth unemployment rate will be approximately 13%. In some countries, the situation was especially dire. In 2021, the youth unemployment rate in Djibouti was nearly 80%, the highest rate on the continent. South Africa followed, with a youth unemployment rate of approximately 64%. Another demographic group frequently affected by high unemployment is women. In 2022, the female unemployment rate in Africa was approximately 9%, compared to 7.4% for men. The continent's average female unemployment rate was not particularly high. However, there were substantial disparities between African nations. Given that youths are the future and pillars of every economy, a high youth unemployment rate may diminish the nation's economic potential. This can be avoided by enhancing education systems, including skilling and technical and vocational education and training, enhancing policies and exploring opportunities with the private sector to create jobs and support youth entrepreneurship. Welcome to Think Rich Africa, the community which brings to you entrepreneurial, business, and personal development content to inform, motivate, and inspire you. We also want to introduce you to our special African development playlist because we strongly believe that entrepreneurship, rather than global pity, is the key to Africa's growth and development. So, if you're African and you aren't subscribed to our community, you're missing out. Twenty-five, Mauritius. The unemployment rate in Mauritius is 6.88% in 2022. According to the International Labour Organization, unemployment is when a person is jobless while actively seeking employment within the previous four weeks. The number of jobless people is divided by the total number of people who are now employed to get at the unemployment rate, which is a measure of how prevalent unemployment is. From 2004 to 2022, Mauritius' employment rate averaged 90.25%, reaching an all-time high of 93.63% in the fourth quarter of 2019. In the first quarter of 2022, Mauritius' unemployment rate rose to 8.7%. The young unemployment rate in Mauritius in 2021 was 25.26%, up 0.7% from the previous year. Twenty-four, Guinea-Bissau. The unemployment rate for Guinea-Bissau in 2022 is 6.63%. 6 
Its crumbling facade, covered in overgrown bougainvilleas and sprinkled with swaying palms, nevertheless bears witness to Bissau's former reputation as one of the most gorgeous of West Africa's coastal towns. Guinea-Bissau, like many other West African nations, is populated primarily by young people. According to the World Bank, Guinea overall Bissau's youth unemployment rate was 12.84% in 2021, up 0.03 percentage points from 2020. In addition, 832,353 people were employed in Guinea-Bissau in that year. In 2021, the latest recent data on the unemployment rates for men and women showed that they were 11.55% and 14.18%, respectively. According to the World Bank, the youth unemployment rate is the fraction of the labor force, ages 15 to 24, not in a job, but looking for one. 23. Central African Republic 6.4% Unemployment Rate In 2021, the Central African Republic's unemployment rate was 6.6%. The Central African Republic's unemployment rate rose at an average yearly rate of 0.72% from 5.8% in 2000 and 2 to 6.6% in 2021. 22. Guinea, 6.19% unemployment rate. The unemployment rate in Guinea in 2021 was 6.34%, up 0.24% from the previous year. The unemployment rate in Guinea for 2020 was 6.1%, a rise of 1.08% from 2019. Guinea's employment rate decreased over time, from 61.49% in 2000 and 2 to 58.18% in 2021. 21. Kenya, 5.53% unemployment rate. In Kenya, the unemployment rate rose from 5.4% in the previous quarter to 6.6% in the first quarter of 2021. For those aged 16 to 24, the unemployment rate was 10.4% from March to May 2022. This is lower than the previous quarter's 11.2% and the prior year's 13.5%. Pre-pandemic levels of 12.3% are now lower. 20. Congo, 5.35% employment rate. The Republic of the Congo's unemployment rate calculates the proportion of the labor force that is actively looking for work. Unemployment was predicted to be 5.4% in 2021 and 5.35% in 2022. The World Bank recently released data showing that the Democratic Republic of the Congo's overall unemployment rate was 5.43% in 2022, an increase of 0.16 percentage points from 2021, and that the country's labor force as a whole was 32,706,320 people. In 2022, the latest available data on the unemployment rates for men and women showed that they were, respectively, 6.05% and 4.73%. 19. Sierra Leone, 5.01% unemployment rate. This country, which is situated on the West African coast, has long relied on the mining industry and mining exports to support its economy. It is rich in mineral deposits, particularly diamonds. The unemployment rate in Sierra Leone in 2021 was 5.33%, up 0.14% from the previous year. Sierra Leone's unemployment rate rose at an average yearly rate of 2.45% from 3.4% in 2000 and 2 to 5.3% in 2021. 18. Zimbabwe, 5% unemployment rate. The unemployment rate in Zimbabwe is expected to reach 5.90% by the end of 2022, according to Trading Economics Global Macro Models and analysts' expectations. Zimbabwe's unemployment rate for 2021 was 5.17%, a 0.18% decline from 2020. 
Zimbabwe's unemployment rate for 2020 was 5.35%. According to the Zimbabwe National Statistics Agency, the unemployment rate in Zimbabwe has reached 19% using the tightest definition of employment. 9 million people, or 59% of the population, were anticipated to be of working age. 38 million people made up the entire labor force as determined by the survey, translating to a total labor force participation rate of 44%. This figure represents the number of people in the labor force as a percentage of the working age population. The employment to population ratio in the country was 35%, with about 3.2 million individuals of working age employed. Around 25% of the population in Herrera, 14% of the population in Mashonland West, and 3% of the population in Matabeland North were employed. According to the poll, 28% of those in employment worked in the formal sector, compared to 45% in the informal sector, with 24% and 4% of those employed in the agricultural and domestic sectors, respectively. About 85% of people who were working did so informally. According to the survey, 26% of the employed population was in the wholesale, retail, and repair of motor vehicles and motorcycles business, followed by 24% in agriculture, forestry, and fishing. It was determined that 19% of people aged 15 and over were unemployed. The rate for men was 18%, while the rate for women was 21%. Seventeen, Burkina Faso, 4.67% unemployment rate. The unemployment rate in Burkina Faso was 4.76% in 2021, a 0.14% decrease from 2020. Burkina Faso had the highest unemployment rate in the world in 2017 with a rate of 77%, Thus, this is a significant improvement. Raising cattle is the most prevalent form of agriculture, making up by far the largest portion of the working population. In Burkina Faso, about 80% of the people cultivate enough food for themselves and their families, with some farmers also producing extra crops for sale. The majority of Burkinade workers are employed in service or industrial jobs, usually in Ouagadougou, Kudugu, Bobo Diou Lasso, or Banfora. Gold is Burkina Faso's biggest export, making it the continent's fourth largest producer of precious metal. 16. Ghana, 4.52% unemployment rate. Ghana is regarded as Africa's democracy powerhouse and has a solid political and governing structure that has contributed to the nation's rapid economic development. Without a question, Ghana is the envy of many African nations due to the progress it has made in fostering democracy. This West African country is recognized as one of the top three in Africa for upholding press and speech freedom and has the greatest GDP per capita in the entire West African region. Because of the abundant and diverse natural resources that have fueled economic expansion, Ghana's economy is thriving. 15. Ethiopian, 4.02% unemployment rate. Ethiopia's economy is built on agriculture, which generates 85% of all employment and 46% of the country's GDP. The unemployment rate in Ethiopia in 2021 was 3.69%, up 0.46% from the previous year. The number of persons actively looking for work in Ethiopia is expressed as a proportion of the labor force. 14. Togo. 3.89% unemployment rate. In 2021, the unemployment rate in Togo was 4%, a rise of 0.06% from 2020. In 2020, Togo's unemployment rate was 3.95%, a rise of 0.23% over 2019. According to the World Bank, Togo's overall youth unemployment rate in 2022 was 9.71%, an increase of 0.15 percentage points from 2021, and the country's total labor force in 2022 was 2,905,557.
In 2022, the most recent unemployment rates for males and women were 12.26% and 7.75%, respectively. 13. Liberia, 3.89% unemployment rate. The Liberian youth unemployment rate in 2021 was 3.23%, a decrease of 0.11% from 2020. According to Trading Economics Global Macro Models and Analysts' Forecasts, Liberia's unemployment rate is anticipated to reach 4.10% by the end of 2022. 12. Mozambique, 3.81% unemployment rate. In 2021, the unemployment rate in Mozambique was 3.98%, a rise of 0.17% from 2020. Mozambique's unemployment rate is projected to decrease from 20.7% in 2014, 2015 to 17.5% in 2019, 20, according to the National Institute of Statistics, INE. This decrease is attributed to the country's common informal and subsistence activities, which are difficult to measure. The measurement includes employees who have had paid labor for at least one hour in the seven days prior to the 2019-2020 household budget survey, which LUSA is presently consulting. The unemployment rate exhibits a declining trend, with no substantial difference between men and women, but with regional differences. The final report states that the rate is 28.9% in urban areas and 11.4% in rural areas. Mozambique's greatest obstacle is diversifying its economy. The administration intends to shift its emphasis away from capital-intensive projects and low-productivity subsistence agriculture. It attempts to strengthen the key drivers of inclusion, such as high-quality education and healthcare delivery, which could improve social indicators. 11. Cameroon, 3.77% unemployment rate. In 2021, Cameroon's unemployment rate was 3.9%. Cameroon's unemployment rate decreased from 6.7% in 2000 and 2 to 3.9% in 2021. According to Trading Economics Global Macro Models and Analysts' Forecasts, Cameroon's unemployment rate is anticipated to reach 3.90% by the end of 2022. 10. Senegal, 3.6% unemployment rate. Senegal is one of the most stable nations in Africa, with an average growth rate of 6% per year since 2014, fueled by public investments in agriculture and infrastructure. In 2021, the unemployment rate in Senegal was 3.72%, an increase of 0.1% from 2020. In 2020, the unemployment rate in Senegal was 3.62%, up 0.76% from 2019. 9. Sauk de Voir, 3.42% unemployment rate. In 2021, the unemployment rate in Ivory Coast stayed constant at 3.50%, the same as in 2020. In 2017, the labor force participation rate in Cote d'Ivoire was 76.8% and the unemployment rate was 6.7%. The workforce participation rate in rural areas is 85%, compared to 68% in urban areas. This trend can also be observed in the discrepancy between urban and rural unemployment rates. The unemployment rate in rural areas is 3%, compared to 12% in metropolitan areas. The paper attributed the significant disparity to the higher proportion of self-employment in rural areas. The country also has a high young unemployment rate, 7.9%, which is common in sub-Saharan Africa. 8. Uganda, 2.92% unemployment rate. The unemployment rate for Uganda in 2021 was 2.94%, a rise of 0.17% from 2020. The 2020 unemployment rate for Uganda was 2.77%, a 0.84% rise from 2019. 
According to trading economics global macro models and analysts' forecasts, Uganda's unemployment rate is projected to reach 3.10% by the end of 2022. 7. Tanzania, 2.63% unemployment rate. According to Trading Economics, Global Macro Models, and Analysts' Forecasts, Tanzania's unemployment rate is projected to reach 9.70% by the end of 2022. In 2021, the unemployment rate in Tanzania was 2.65%, a rise of 0.12% from 2020. The projected unemployment rate for Tanzania in 2020 was 2.53%. Tanzania is among the top 10 African nations with the highest paying employment. This East African nation has enjoyed relative political stability, which has fostered economic expansion. Tanzania has avoided both internal and external political crises, whereas many other African nations are trying to recover economically following civil wars and political unrest. The majority of Tanzania's internal disagreements over resource usage and distribution were minor and never escalated into violent confrontations. 6. Madagascar 2.42% Unemployment Rate Madagascar's unemployment rate increased from 2.50% in 2020 to 2.60% in 2021. According to the World Bank, the total youth unemployment rate in Madagascar in 2022 was 4.82%, an increase of 0.36 percentage points from 2021, and the total workforce in 2022 was 14462 million people. In 2022, the male and female unemployment rates were 5.19 and 4.43%, respectively. Madagascar's employment-to-population ratio increased from 82% in 2020 to 82.3% in 2021. 5. Chad, 1.77% unemployment rate. This country has one of the lowest unemployment rates in Africa. In 2021, the unemployment rate in Chad grew from 1.70% to 1.90%. The unemployment rate in Chad measures the proportion of the labor force that is actively seeking employment. Chad is Africa's fifth largest country by land area, with a rapidly expanding population. Chad has the world's highest population of camels, the tenth largest oil reserves in Africa, and populations of goats, sheep, and cattle in or around the top ten. Oil and agriculture are the primary economic drivers of Chad. The majority of export earnings and government revenues are derived from oil. Gold, gum arabic, sesame, livestock, and cotton are the principal non-oil exports of Chad. The bulk of Chad's population is dependent on subsistence agriculture and livestock husbandry. 4. Burundi, 1.66% unemployment rate. In 2021, Burundi's unemployment rate was 1.8%, although Burundi's unemployment rate has fluctuated significantly in recent years. It has tended to rise between 2002 and 2021, peaking at 1.8% in 2021. 3. Rwanda, 1.5% unemployment rate. Rwanda's employment rate fell from 46.50% in the fourth quarter of 2021 to 45.50% in the first quarter of 2022. In the first quarter of 2022, the unemployment rate decreased by 7.3 percentage points, from 23.8% in the fourth quarter of 2021 to 16.5% in the first quarter of 2022. The unemployment rate for women remained significantly higher than that of men, 18.2%, 15.0%. It is also substantially greater among the population between the ages of 16 and 30 to 21.5%, compared to those aged 31 and older, 13.1%. 2. Benin, 1.46% unemployment rate. The unemployment rate in Benin in 2021 
was 1.57%, a decrease of 0.01% from 2020. 2020 Benin's unemployment rate was 1.58%, an increase of 0.11% from 2019. According to Trading Economics Global Macro Models and Analysts' Forecasts, the unemployment rate in Benin is predicted to reach 1.70% by the end of 2022. 1. Niger, employment rate 0.79%. Finally, number one on our list today is Niger with an unemployment rate of 0.79%. Niger is one of the largest countries in Africa and the 22nd largest country in the world. A substantial proportion of the population resides in rural areas. The Niger unemployment rate is anticipated to reach 1% by the end of 2022, according to Trading Economics Global Macro Models and Analysts' Forecasts. In 2021, the unemployment rate in Niger was 0.75%, a 0.13% increase over 2020. Unemployment has many negative consequences, including increased depression and other mental health problems, increased crime rates, overall lower economic productivity and consumption, lower rates of volunteerism, and skill erosion. Surprisingly, extraordinarily low unemployment might result in economic difficulties, such as excessive inflation. This might result in higher living costs, which can be especially difficult for citizens in emerging and or low-income nations. A low unemployment rate does not always imply that a country's citizens are living in good long-term conditions. According to an international labor organization assessment, many of the world's 3.3 billion nominally employed individuals work under subpar conditions that provide little compensation, low economic security, and little to no possibility for progress. It is possible to have low unemployment while also having a prosperous economy. A low unemployment rate does not imply that a country's economy is in good shape. According to the World Bank, Niger had only 0.8% unemployment in 2021, although its GDP per capita was $594.9. Thank you for your time. If you have any tips that you think should be included in this video, please leave a comment and let us know. Help us grow our channel. We hope you found this video helpful. Support us by liking the video, subscribing, and turning on notifications.